Bow her knees on down. And even in the lower part of your back, right in the backbone, your tailbone, what you'd call it, been giving you some trouble. I feel the Holy Ghost even in the bed. You try to move and you ache back there. But by the power of God, power of God, power of the Holy Bahoka. Hallelujah. Praise Him. Okay. Father, right now, Lord, she's having some problem right in this part of her body and upper part of her stomach, Lord. Oh, God, I appreciate you, Jesus. It's happening right now. Hallelujah. By the power of Jesus Christ, be healed. Be made whole. I see a vision. I see a... But it's a... I see a man coming up before me. I nearly did say it was a, maybe your a son, but it's somebody close to you. But he's out there in the world doing things that don't need to be doing. And you've been carrying that burden, but God fixing answer your prayer there, ma'am. I said, God done heard your prayer. God's fixing to save them and restore them back to God and you're healed. Praise Him. Huh. Oh, that's okay. We all have to. Father, right now, Lord, she, she needs a spiritual overhaul. Lord, give her a spiritual. We, we read that in the Bible. Restore us in the Holy Ghost. Restore us. In our faith, oh God, right now, Lord. Thank God. I'm seeing God going back a little over 10 years. Thank God. Close family members. But God, right now, is, is bringing you back to where you was. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You was in your 20s or somewhere in that time. Hallelujah. And you were saved. And the devil's just little bit little. You got your way. But now that fire is coming back from God. That fire. That fire. Huh? Right now, go here. Okay, I understand. Father, right now, you know, this is very important. That's what's wrong with these churches. People don't, they can't get restored and get a restoration. They're too busy. And the deacons and the preachers, they ain't, they ain't what to end with. As long as you got, they got that number in there. God, right now, Lord, He wants a restoration. Lord, all this force has been battling against Him for the last few years. I just, when I said that, I saw a call of God on your life. Somewhere back there, you had a call to, to get out your and preach Jesus, to tell folks about Jesus, but the devil tried to head you off. But right now, we head the devil off. By the power of God. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Oh God. Oh, I see the washing of the water of the Word of God. The Spirit of God. Anything in your life that's ain't supposed to be there, the Lord is blotting it out right now. Hallelujah. But I see it's just like he's, a, he's putting his hand on you for his work. Oh, Hallelujah. God ain't through with you. 
I said, God ain't through with you. Hallelujah. Don't think that you can't get out there and preach Jesus and lift Jesus up. The Holy Ghost. The fire. There's been one, one thing that's been worn against you again and again. But right now, put a curse on it. It will not bother you no more. Oh! No more! God, through the Holy Ghost, cast it in the sea of forgetfulness. Thank you, Lord. Oh, hallelujah. For my spiritual life, and I miss my pastor, pa pastor Kerry. Huh? I for, just pray for my spiritual life and my pastor Kerry. He died out. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost. And I've been noticing this time. I've been all over this country and I just got back from out of the country. People are, there's something out there in the elements that people are wanting to get back to God. They are. There's something other warning the people to get their sails back on fire for God. Back on fire for God. And I've been over in countries where you wouldn't even thought there was any Christians. Oh, I feel the fire of the Holy Ghost. God, right now, Lord, I restore the joy of her salvation. God, that prayer that she used to have and that, that, that hungry to read the Bible. Oh, the Bible's been laying on the shelf, but God, she's fixing to start reading it again by the Holy Ghost. And that devil that's been telling her that she's gone, gone overboard, devil, you're a liar. By the power of God. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost. Power of the Holy Ghost. There it is, a fire. I want the Lord to help me. I'm going to pass it here this day. Right now. I'm trying to get the hurt. Father, right now, Lord, you heard all of this. Lord, go down in her chest and her body and move all of this out, Lord. God, that's what you took those lashes for, Lord Jesus. As when you cried out the last words from the cross, Jesus, over 2,000 years ago, Father, forgive them, for they know not what to do. Thank you, Jesus. You died for our sins, and you was lacerated, whipped for our healing. By your stripes, by the power. Ah! Ah! Thank you, Lord. Oh, I feel it. Thank God. Whoa. Glory. Glory. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Huh. In my chest and back. I mean, I'll be. Okay. Uh, uh, lay your hand across right there. Father, Lord, right here in her chest. Lord, did I lay my hand upon this lady's hand over this chest for your glory. Lord, move all of this out that given her problem in here and her breathing and her. Jesus and the pressure in the name of Jesus and it sometimes puts a pressure in your your head your brain you know the, you feel pressure but he's casting oh there it went power 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 in Jesus name glory Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost. Come on, praise Him. Y'all, hands paralyzed or something, you can't raise them. Lift them up, y'all, and tell Jesus, you know, glory. Oh. Oh, I feel it. Father, you give her this Holy Ghost miracle and give her this Miracle in her body. Oh, I feel it. Give her this quickening. Lord, you said we were quickened by the power. Oh! Thank 
keep praising him. Just keep praising him. Hallelujah. God's going to hear you've had a lot of pain, but you ain't going to have that no more. And your blood pressure been up. You feel pressure in your shoulders. But God's fixed. But you also got three, probably family members, something about your family that's away from God. And I've been in some real heavy evil. Oh, God! Whoa. God, I said it. Thank you, Lord. I don't know these things, but he do. You know? As he knows all about. Come on, praise him. It's a revelation. It's just something that I can't help. Thank the Lord. Okay. Well, I feel it. God, do I feel the Holy Ghost. Father, right now, all her shortcomings and failures and neglect, or prayed and didn't, should have read the Bible and done something else, stayed out of church. But right now, Lord, the Holy Ghost is taking total control over you, sister, and your body is being healed with it. You've been under pressure, like your blood pressure be up. But I see the fire and the power. But the greatest thing I see is the Holy Ghost and fire entering back into you. Ohio. Waha. Oh. Susti. Shishi. Misha. Bahaya. Oh, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Oh. My Lord. Everything's going to be all right. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. What I'm seeing it, I'd say it's a brother, but it might be someone closer than that, but I see a brother of yours, and I believe it's really out there in sin, backslider, and it's really have upset you. But God has heard your prayer, ma'am. God's heard your prayer. Now this is not a this is a Holy Ghost. This ain't me. Hallelujah. This is the Holy Ghost. Okay. Well, oh, I feel it. Father, right now, Lord, give her the restoration. But your blood's up too. But God fixes all that. Hallelujah. You're having some female trouble. But all that's being fixed too. But the power. God, I restore her. I restore the joy of the Lord. But her body may hold. My God, get a little of it. Power. Hold it. Hold it. Hallelujah. Praise him. Praise him. Come on, lift them hands up to the Lord. Okay. Father, right now. Lord, you heard this request. Lord, what greater things would do? You know, you find in the Bible where some of the biblical people of the Bible would call on God, Lord, restore my, the joy of my salvation. Restore me. That's what she needs is, is a spiritual resurrection. Thank God. But she do need some healing, but she put in the Want back with God first. Where well, she gonna get them both? Yes, both of them. Yes, both of them. Yes, you're getting the yes, God back, and you're getting your yes, the love of God back, and you're getting the power of God back. Yes, 
You're getting Jesus back. You're getting hunger back. You're getting Bible reading back by the path of Be made well and whole. And I impart in you the fire, fire of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. I just want to, uh, you know, sometimes when I get in prayer, I just don't want to come out. I just want this word to mean nothing to me. I just want to love God. Bless your heart. Father, you heard all of this. Come on, people, praise him. God in Jesus' name. God in Jesus' name. God in Jesus' name. Oh, I feel it. Oh, God, in the name of Jesus. Be it so, Lord. Be it so, Lord. That the fire of the Holy Ghost. And God, right now, Jesus, this thing that's been tormenting her, I take it out of your mind. I take it out of your heart. Hallelujah. You ain't going to be tormenting that devil no more. By the power of Jesus Christ. Father, right now, Lord, you see this young man, Lord. Lord, he wants you. He needs you. God, he wants to be real. He wants. He want. He wants to serve you. The beauty of holiness, Lord. God, young guys like him, Lord, out under the worldliness of the worldliness. Just look like they don't even believe in God. But Lord, I pray right now, any power has been worn against this young man, I bind it. I bind it, God. God, I bind it, Lord. Somebody out there has raised him to serve you. Taught him to serve you, Lord. Might be a a family member, but somebody, Lord, let that power stay with him. And right now, through your authority, Lord, renew him in the Holy Ghost. Renew him in Jesus Christ. I feel it. And Lord, if you tarry that long, another 10, 15, 20 years, Lord, let him become a preacher. Let him become a preacher, Lord. If he, if he, if he gets up in the twenties or late teens, let something supernatural transform his world, Lord. We need, we need a new crop of soldiers of the cross. I mean, believe we need a new crop. We need a new crop. Glory. How many are they? Are there three all together? Thank you, Lord. Give me one more. Oh, hallelujah. Father, right now. God, I thank you. Glory. God, I behold you. God, I behold you. God, I behold you, o Lamb of God. God, I behold you, o Lamb of God. You heard all her requests. Open the windows of heavens upon her. Open the gates of heaven upon her, Lord. And her natural and physical of family needs, Lord. Let all of that get back on full-blooded, sold out to Jesus' spirit in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. You know, just well to get in, as we call in Alabama, a nut. You, you, you city folks, y'all, y'all know what that word nut is. <laughs> 
I was in Alabama. <laughs> Anybody know what a netting is? Y'all say another one up here. <laughs> oh, I feel the Lord bless you. Praise God. Just in prayer. Can I hug you? I ain't seen you in a while. Praise God. Amen. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Father, right now, Lord, you see her needs. God, in the name of Jesus. God, spiritually, physically. Thank you, Lord. Give her a miracle, God. There's someone in your family I don't know how close has done a lot to try to deter you and get you out of church and away from the Lord. But God is with you. He's, I, I look back and you was, look like in your teens, somewhere back there, when God began to deal with you. And that's the way God wants you. Hallelujah. And ever who it is in the family that, that, that don't believe in all this, God is going to build a hedge about you. Oh, hallelujah. They ain't going to interfere your Christian life. I see a double portion of the Holy Ghost coming down on you. I see the Lord re re rebuking him powers out there of, of supposed to be family. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, all of you. Praise her. Give her that for her family. Give him a praise, people. Well, this is this a match striking tonight. We ain't got the woods on fire yet. God said, set the woods on fire around here. And then believe we need the woods on fire. We don't need no one of the things except lights a cigarette. We need some matches. And I feel some matches coming in. Oh. Hallelujah. I had one test. I got an ulcer in my stomach and I got a softness problem. I couldn't help eat. Thank the Lord. And then I got a blood clog in my ankle. Father, right now, Lord, you see this. It's, she can't eat like she needs to and like she wants to. So go down in this stomach, Lord, and, and what's called, oh! Let's just wipe it all out. Wipe it all out. Wipe it all out. Oh, I feel it. Thank you, Lord. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let's praise Him, everybody. Some glad morning we shall see Jesus in the air. Oh, I can, you know, I don't, I can't read nothing but the Bible. I guess I could. I think I appreciate that. You know, I said, Lord, the Lord showed me that that there was about three people could. Bring a hundred dollars up here to help this offering. God will prosper you like you ain't never been prospered. He'll bless you, and He'll do some things you need. You try God, and it will help toward uh, increasing. Cause I'm out here full time, and ever who you are, if you'll do that, you'll never regret this all the days of your life. You'll see God will turn your finances around because God knows how to do it. I said, God knows how to do it. Prove Him. God, right now, Lord, in this woman's upper stomach, and it goes on up in your chest too, in one of your breasts, this pressure there. But by the power of God, power! And sometimes when you already sit down or getting up, you have dizzy spells, but you won't have that no more. By the power of the Holy Ghost, Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Here's one of them. Thank the Lord. Glory. Glory. Thank 
kids. No, go again. I ask that the Lord come back into my life and lead me on the right path to watch over my family and kids. You got any children? Huh? You got you have any children? Yes. How many are there? Three. See, I'm Norton, three handkerchiefs. God gonna remember. Thank you, Lord. God showed me this, Lord, right now, Lord, you let these young ones be brought up in the fear and the admiration of the Lord. Let everything get fixed, Lord, for them in Jesus' name. Oh, Holy One of Israel. Oh, God, move the hindrance out of the way. And Lord, let him do a work for God. Let him, and the Lord, the labors of the preachers in these last days are falling away. Let him be one of these last day servants of the Lord. In Jesus' name. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Glory. Thank the Lord. Someone say thank the Lord. That's all right. God bless you. Someone say thank you. You know, someone might be a critic. One, two, three, four, five. Hold, oh, there's two. One, two, three, four, five. There's three. One, two, three, four, five. What was that five? Four. Someone say praise the Lord. Thank God. Thank you, Jesus. There's another hundred dollars makes it five. Someone say thank the Lord. There's another hundred dollars makes it one more to show in case there is some critic that I know what I'm talking about. I'm sold out. Follow Jesus. Hallelujah. What what we need here? Let me tie this around there. Rena, keep this tied around there. My Lord. I have a little spaniel. There's a nudding. Now back where I come from, we call them a nudding. Did anybody else come up on the nudding family? <laughs> There's another nudding. <laughs> Let's thank God for this. Because it's, 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 it's not for me, it's to help me to get His Word. Now going areas, I just came back from out of the country and we will pray for this. And I'll do it right now. Let me pray for you. But I, Father, right now, Lord, we ask you to bless her. You see what she needs and I pray for these needs that's written in this yes, card, Lord, that ever thing will come to pass and answer in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank the Lord. Ooh. Now we're all having a morning service, aren't we? I reckon so. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure we are. Yeah, we're having a morning service. And it's going to be more of a teaching. Thank the Lord in helping you. Uh, uh, to be what you want to be for the Lord. It's all right. What's happening, ma'am? I, I don't that. Uh, 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 okay. Oh, I see. <laughs> Lord, right now, Lord, I pray right now, move all this off the line. If there's any in the eye, let a miracle. Oh! Of God. Oh my. Oh. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost fall on her. Fire of the Holy Ghost. 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 Thank God. Thank the Lord now have that. Oh, it's okay? Thank God bless you. Let's praise the Lord, will you? My Lord. There's a nothing. And there's another nothing. Someone said, God's going to help this brother Terrell to get this gospel. Well, Jesus can come. I tell you. And I thank God for my wife. I don't know where 
I probably done be going on to be with the Lord and been for her. But she stood me these last 30 years, a little over, uh, summers in that area, and took care of the natural and been with me some. 